my member of parliament, my boss, my hard-working fighter, the Honorable Rodney Charles. <laughs> Councillors, my colleagues, members of the slate, I say thank you very much to everyone for giving me the opportunity once. Because sometimes an opportunity comes only once. My brothers and sisters, there is a few burning questions that has been bothering my soul as I move from 2015 to 2020, moving into 2025. And I want to ask you a few questions here tonight. Are we content with the UNC at present? Are we happy with where our great party is at this moment? My brothers and sisters, if we want to lead UNC into a new era of effective governance, then we must make sure and make way for a change for a stronger UNC. Because a stronger UNC is a stronger TNT, my brothers and sisters. Remember that our symbol is the praying hand. And when you go to that poll on June the 15th, remember to vote for the praying hands. What are you going to vote for, my brothers and sisters? The praying hands. I want to once again ask, I would like to urge everyone to reflect at the current state of our party. I am not here to waste my time on what is irrelevant. I know everybody came out from their homes to listen to something, a message. And I am here in my humble way as a servant of Naparima and a, soil, a, a, a son of the soil and a national of Trinidad and Tobago. Is this the UNC we know? Absolutely not. Is this the UNC can take us into government? And I want to ask you that, that question one more time. And I want to hear your answer. Hear it loud. Is this the UNC that will take us into government? No. My brothers and sisters, are we ready in our present form to inspire our youths and regain the confidence of the electorate? I am sure these questions you are asking yourself daily. You are hearing this from in the, the public domain but there is a solution the solution is right before you the solution here tonight to let you know that the united patriots has the solution to take you into governance in 2025 and my brothers and sisters there is only one way to do that on June the 15th, you must remember to vote the praying hands. Let that register in your brain. Go to sleep with it. Say it in your prayers. Get up in the morning and say it again. Because June the 15th, if you make that mistake, brother and sister, propose smoke we buy. I have been a dedicated UNC member for many 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 years and i am ready for that change that is needed within the party within many with with my many years as a naprima constituency office manager and part of the naprima constituency executive i understand the principles of the united national congress i am not no newcomer to this business i have been around been there done that and my brothers and sisters, I am aware of what the party needs at this time and the, compu and the community concerns. Let me tell you a little bit. As office manager and an active member of the UNC, I have successfully driven a number of UNC activities as well as constituency events. I believe in fostering strong relationships between the UNC and the people, which means that it is about you, you the membership, you the people. It is not from the top bottom. It is supposed to, when you're building a house, it's from the bottom top. You don't put on the roof first. You don't put on the dressing first. You don't hang up the curtains. 
and I am telling you, the foundation is right there before you. The foundation is in the United Patriots. And remember that praying hands, my brothers and sisters. In my present role, I have, I have, I have been tied to many activities in the party, inside and outside of the Naprima constituency. From community and cottage meetings, campaigning events, communi community meetings with the TTPS and municipal police. I have been right through in the, within the constituency of Naparima and environs. Ho hosting community meetings together with our Naparima constituency executive. Give them a round of applause. Give our hard-working member of parliament for Naparima a round of applause because this is what we do in Naparima we work hard we work diligent we work fearless we have been instrumental through all these outreach programs to establish watch groups something that is plaguing the community crime and criminal activities throughout the constituency of Naparima partnering with the police some of which up to today are very fruitful very active my brothers and sisters this is what we need to take our great party forward hard work not lazy people we need hard-working people and the hard-working team is before you i want to emphasize that because you know why you want this change your presence here tonight indicates clearly that there is a cry for something more important and the more important thing is that you need life and livelihood in a constructive and meaningful manner you want goods and goods and services delivered to you my brothers and sisters I, I have been working with the regional corporation, every councillor come election, local election, executive election, NATEX election, general election, all the elections, working hard for the success of the United National Congress. And therefore, nobody could tell me that I am not a UNC and I will not stand for that. If you try it, well, that, that is your business. You're fooling me with that. It ever bothering me no way inside my blood. Because inside this blood is UNC. And I am a strong UNC. I will remain a UNC. And I stand firm behind the policies of the United National Congress. But what I am quite certain about, it is that the function in arms of the United National Congress should be activated and working effectively. And again, I will tell you, the only way to get that is on June the 15th, Vote the praying hands. Most importantly, this cannot be done without you, the members. You, the members, have the power. The power is in your hand. The power is in your brother's hand. The power is in your father, your mother. Every member. And your mission here, after you leave here tonight, is to ensure that every member of the United National Congress be told that this is your last chance. There is no chance after this. Somebody called me just recently. And they said to me, they say, Wayne, we have hope. But this is the last hope. After this, we could as well hit the burial ground. That is how bad we reach. We should not be in a position like this. We have the answers. But you know what we don't have? We don't have the right people. We have the right people in front of us right here. My brothers and sisters, be reminded. Do not be fooled that on June the 15th, the United Patriots and the Praying hands. And finally, I want to urge and beg of you, please do not be distracted. Do not allow 
ignore the dis distractors and most importantly forget about the unnecessary propaganda people could say what they want about you as one as as long as it ain't affecting your integrity in any way you forget about them everybody entitled to their opinion right so you know you have the right recipe go ahead and use it make unc great again make the united national congress great again i pledge to you tonight i will give you 100 percent to work diligently honestly and effectively to strengthen our great party as the south regional representative that is my pledge to you tonight and everybody in this room who knows me and all the members of the united national congress i am telling you i am known they just do not want to recognize good thing when they see it they have a problem with that anytime they see something good they do not recognize it they push it apart and brothers and sisters you can rely on me you know that to get the job done together with my colleagues i asked my brother from northeast and I, I was opposed. I said, Where are you bringing the man from quite northeast? I said, He wants to serve. This man ready to work. He ready to work throughout the length and breadth of Trinidad and Tobago. We have a Tobago representative, a young bright Chanel. This is what this, this, this United Patriots and had no room for lazy people. Our leader had said, If you are ready to work, pack up and go. Back up one time because june the 16th we are ready to hit the serve you the membership of the party so my brothers and sisters i urge you to jo join with the mission of the united patriots and on june the 15th vote for change vote for unity vote for good governance vote vote for accountability vote for excellence for a prosperous future for life and livelihood because it depends on you and on saturday june the 15th vote the united patriots vote the praying hands vote the praying hands vote the praying hands because a stronger UNC is a stronger TNT. I thank you very much.